What's going on everyone? Let's unbox the small rig CT20 aluminum tripod. I just got this in today. I didn't write a video out or anything about the specs. I just figured we'd do a raw unboxing. I wanted something that was light, but also met a few specifications of stuff that I was looking for. So this is the packaging, nice sleek black box. The tripod I'm currently using is like a generic brand, kind of like this, but it has the twist turn um, to extend and retract the legs, and I really hate that. Now, the thing that attracted me to this one is it supposedly has a fluid head. So let's see. Little case um, that I'll probably never put it in again. This thing is like 78 bucks. So if it's anything like the other small rig tripod I got, the AD01, um, for the price point, small rig's really starting to kill it. Oh shit. Okay, stuff is flown out everywhere. So what do we get? We got, not that I'll ever use this, tripod or uh, mobile mount comes in. I actually might use that. We got base plate. Ooh, nice. Second base plate. Uh, bullet butt plugs. No, <laughs> don't fucking know. Uh, let's see. Dig it up. There we go. Like a little bullet butt plug. Uh, are you out there? Do you knock on the door? Yeah, take it. Fucking interrupt the video again. Three tools. And the tripod itself um, already feels way better quality than the one my camera's currently on. This was the big thing. Oh, hold on. Right here. This is what I wanted. More than anything, these little quick releases. Oh my God, it's so much better. It's aluminum, it feels better than that one. Uh, I'll be honest, doesn't feel, you know, it's not like feeling like a Manfrotto or anything like that by any means, but $78. Uh, these pieces are plastic, so I will have to be careful with those. Um, I'm typically pretty rough with gear. Let's move this aside. Ow, motherfucker. All right, so right out the gate, um, besides the, the head one right here, these knobs are plastic. This one, um, it's not a fluid head. Uh, it, you know what, it's a fluid, let me see. Something don't feel right here. Make sure that's on tight. Okay, now let's see. Okay, so what it is, you can do, it's a fluid pan. This was more so a want for vlogging. And I do use tripods a lot during weddings. What I will do is, if I'm not shooting handheld, typically I'm on a tripod. Uh, leave a comment below if you want a video of my approach to weddings and whether I use tripod, gimbal, or handheld, because I do use all three but for a specific situation. So leave a comment below if you're interested in maybe seeing a video like that. Um, what I do like is right here on the back, you got the little level. You can see if you're level or not. From your view, you got one from the side view, and then you got also a bubble level right over here. And seeing, you know, I could already tell I'm gonna like it. Stay tuned because I will do an updated video of field testing this thing. If you guys haven't already, I'd appreciate giving the video a thumbs up, helps with the algorithm, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you in the next video.